Grocery stores are now setting dedicated areas for organic food. And while these products are often marketed as the healthiest option, does every food benefit from being organically produced? Even things that say organic mac and cheese, there's really no nutritional value, it's just calories and fat. Dr. Gina Dorenzo Coffey of Boys Town Pediatrics partnered with hy V to host classes on how organic differs from conventional food, especially when it comes to childhood nutrition. I really would like to see families, you know, sitting down to eat together more, learning how to cook whole grains, learning how to cook healthier foods. In addition to offering some nutritious meals during the class, Gina explained some food products that benefit from natural processing. When comparing peanut butter, ranging from the alternative Nutella to naturally made peanut butter, the amount of sugar ranges from the primary ingredient in Nutella to non-existent in natural peanut butter products. While organic foods can be a step in the right direction for some people, Dr. Gina says that an abundance of sugars and grains are the main problems in children's diets. And this is a result from unhealthy snacks and the traditional food pyramid model of nutrition. When you pare down between natural and things that are not considered natural, the healthier fats as opposed to the unhealthy fats being added to the foods that aren't natural is a huge one, and then the amount of sugar being added, really. So you're really looking at your you know, hydrogenated fats and sugar content, and if you can decrease those by going to natural food, definitely that's healthier. For the Omaha News, I'm Dylan Senf.